master in the ceramics and the design business area. Then uh, we are uh, looking forward to learn her uh, experience that comes up from his, uh, her very pretty background. So please, your turn, uh, Professor Inilogina. Tamam mı? Evet. Başlayayım mı peki? Evet. From Potter's Lake to CNC Lake. Ee, burada e, e-maillerimiz var. Hani şey soru sormak isterseniz lütfen bana e-mail yapın. E, soru sözlü değil, yazılı cevap vermek istiyorum sorusu olanlara. Evet. Ee, summary. Peter's Hill is one of the oldest latest of the cultural history and it shares the same core as CNC tool. A prototyping axle. Therefore, it is possible to say that the CNC lake dates back to 3500 BC. I, as an experienced ceramist, have shown a great fancy towards the potter's wheel and used it to design and produce product many of my ceramic articles. Now we experience it producing some of my former design by using CNC tool with the valuable contribution of Mr. Sinan Elefan, former, former research associate at Industrial Design Department of the ITU, Istanbul Technical University Architecture Faculty. Our, um, be a our world has entered the digital age with an amazing speed and our country did not wait for 300 uh, years to adopt this digital age unlike the case for printing press this new age introduced uh, many advantages to our lives while sweeping out numerous habits but it is still possible to use both Potasville and CNC tool under the same roof, probably thanks to the above mentioned core core they share. The new generation has born into a digital world and preserved this situation as a debt, uh, and it has become a necessity and responsibility for us as the older generation to learn this new language in order to communicate with the old and understand the digital age. I am a member of the ceramic community as an artist and lecturer for more than 50 years. Potter's wheel had always been my favorite during this time. It took me a very long time to learn how to operate this tool, but I have understood and uh, resolved all the associated difficulties over the time and managed to develop a very practical method to teach them to my students. Therefore, my students did not face the difficulties that I have faced in using the potter's wheel, and uh, most of times they use it better than me. They lowered this tool as much as, uh, as, much as I did. <clears throat> well, if I was studying ceramic engineering ab abroad between 1968 and uh, 72, we had to use for our art account transaction to a tall scarlet slide rule uh, after I had returned to the country in mid 1972 new electronic calculators was actual suddenly disappeared the manual calculators now you can see maybe some of them in museums in those years 70s 80s be the owner of a, a typewriter were among their luxuries, but in the mid-19s, they suddenly also began to disappear and replacing them with computer. Uh, slider rules, which is nowadays out of circulation, maybe in some of the older <laughs> friends in Northwest, but the young people haven't seen that, I think. <clears throat> uh, not considered in the use of typewriter, this is a typewriter. <clears throat> Youth of the digital world did not have any contact with the ones before. Digital life is very natural to them. 
So neither we had to live in separate worlds with you or learn the language of this age and try to live with them side by side. Computer, email, digital camera, computer-aided drawing, computer-aided design, etc. have become elements of the daily language. The one that attracted me the most is the computer-aided design. So I tried to learn using Iran Seros drawing program, which is thought to be relatively easier to learn. In my uh, 2009, I attended a workshop in Korea conducted by uh, International Society for Ceramic Art Education and Exchange. There I witnessed that Potter's wheel was accompanied by CNC tool and that all students were able to use them both. I wondered and asked me when we could do that. <clears throat> this it is a look from this uh, workshop. <clears throat> During the nine, uh, 2009 uh, ceramic workshop in Korea, let in the same places potter's wheel and the cnc tool every students were able to use both as you see uh, as can be seen the students exhibit their designs that made that made on the cnc machine the electric potter's wheel is seen in the background it is an electric potter's wheel you see it is in on, under the same tent both two <clears throat> Uh, it is the same, it is the design made by CNC and we are this is uh, potter's wheel, electric potter's wheel here, uh, one, a girl working for uh, Washington, I think. Right. Mm. You see, Seoul National University of Technology in the same workshop, we could see by students the using of a very traditional potter's wheel, which they performing on it a rather big package jazz. I am retired from Marmara University of Fine Arts Faculty at the end of 2008. Then I happily accepted formal offer from the head of the IE, ITU Industrial Design Department of Architecture Faculty Professor Dr. Nyan Nyan Bayezid because of their CNC rate inventory. I began to <coughs> lecture ceramic courses in ITU or Finance Department as of uh, 209. Then I met Mrs. Nan Ödegan, a research associate at Industrial Design Department of ITU Architecture Faculty, who is originally a mechanical engineer. But he was interested in ceramic and willing to use potter's wheel. I happily taught him how to use potter's wheel and told him that I wanted to work with a CNC tool. Then I began to use rhinoceros program to draw models and molds, some of my designs that I had created by using potter's wheel. Mr. Sinan Edepon transferred them to solid program, ensuring their adaptation to the CNC tool. So we created our plaster molds on CNC tool and produced our ceramic product uh, by way of slip casting. We would like to share this process and things to do with you. Nowadays, we certainly do not intend to use a slider rule or typewriter, but the findings of the first wheel have been discovered during the archaeological excavation in the Mesopotamian region that documents 3500 BC. Although the findings of wheel and pottery discs are found around the same time, it is still not as certain by the archaeologists whether the wheel or the pottery disc was invented first. By the way, uh, the first foot operated wheel is found on a wall painting of an Egyptian temple on Fiala Isan dating back to 300 BC. Potter's wheel is still in parallel of CNC benches being in the life of self assured man. 
In fact, the potter's wheel and CNC which is a common quarry aerotyping axle. On account of before moving forward with studies which we realized together, Mr. Sinan Ödekan, I would like to mention briefly of these two tools, the history story. Not too long. A brief overview to the history of potter's wheel. Mankind began to shape clay into pottery dates back almost two eight thousand years. A research conducted in Anatolia between 1972 and 78 showed the development of potter's wheel from Neolithic age until today in living situation. Uh, the, this research, uh, by the way, this research belonged to me. I did it. I did it. <clears throat> Um, right. Another was the day, um, first, uh, first, the clay was shaped by using two hands, and then people shaped clay into bus supports with sharp buttons, which can be considered as the first example of potter's wheel. Then, this base support was inserted onto a fixed axle that is a turning. This was followed by putting the axle into a ball bearing system that provided a faster turning speed by using the centrifugal force, as you can see below. Then, uh, and finally, the axle was attached to two discs, smaller one on the top, and larger one at the bottom, creating the potter's wheel that can be turned by using food. All of these developments are a result of a very long process. But now, uh, nowadays, electric uh, potter's wheel are preferred by most of potters. All of these developments are a result of a very long process. Shaping of clay on a disc turned by hand or foot on an axle with the help of centrifugal force is an important milestone in the history of culture. It is also worth mentioning that the utilization of rotating axle is considered as the ancestor of the first numeric control. Changes in clay shaping methods give us tip about the history of development of mankind, helping understand cultural development by means of pottery making techniques. Before, ceramic artifacts are just like computers that witnessed the aims. A magnificent full could start sculpture designed by using elements machined on the potter's wheel by Sibel Alfarsan, she has been my student at Marmara University, finance faculty. Fantastic pot designed by using elements machined on the potter's wheel by Shula Dermes, she has been also my student in Marmara University, finance faculty. Uh, a beautiful story of CNC tool, as I mentioned above, the history of a classic of CNC lattice is as old as the history of Minecraft. During the World War II, when it was understood in US that the current lattice became insufficient to make the recruitment of the developing military industry. industry. Person cooperation meet the Institute of Technology conducted a course study and at 1952 and signed a significant success when they manufactured the first lay with numeric control machine. Two manufacturers began to produce uh, letters with the NSA system and finally adaptation of the rapidly evolving computer technology into this system was resulted in CNC, computer numeric control.
Sin City which plays at Istanbul Technical University of Fine of Architecture Department Industrial Design Department. Uh, our first design is the soup plate that I made by using Porter's wheel in 205. By using core casting method with plaster mold made on CNC tool, after CNC, um, it looks different. Taking the drawing of the top and bottom molds of soup plate created by using brain course program for the purpose of loading to CNC. <clears throat> this is another part of the plate, uh, plaster plate, plaster mold for the plate. <laughs> uh, while the drawings are controlling by Mr. Sinan and is calculated the necessary commands to the CNC, CNC tools are suitable for direct molding and as well as modeling. For this, it uses a kind of polyurethane which is dangerous to build and product is too much powder. Since it is necessary to use plaster for mass production of ceramic molds, rectangular or circular plaster blocks are cast to the larger dimension of mold pieces. These blocks are then placed properly on the CNC tool for shipping. Plaster blocks produce also powder during shipping, but they do not produce too much dust because of the heavy weight of plaster particles. Uh, pouring of plaster blocks from the plaster. Start of carving on CNC. Model covered with powder is a result of sipping of plaster block on CNC tool to form the mold. Um, with uh, vacuum cleaner, uh, it, it must be clean uh, with vacuum cleaner, this does. Uh, a part of the plate, uh, the cluster mold, the finished part of the mold that we form the inside of plate. Casting of plate by using color casting method with porcelain casting clay. Uh, this this is necessary. It is uh, then, then we can uh, we know that it is the casting is correct. The security <laughs> look. Uh, our plaster molds are made by using CNC. We could only see the result by casting with casting mood in the ITU, the, the finance department, condition, uh, but such plates forms are protected by pressing under industrial condition. So, a dinner set was designed along with the above mentioned workflow. Our second application was a Turkish copper cup, which I have productive in 1996 by using the potter's wheel. <clears throat> uh, mass production is also possible by hand, but with uh, potter's wheel, of course. Mm -hmm. The same copper cup applied it by using the CNC. Handles can be cast in different color if they see it. <clears throat> Turkish cup a cup in series. The philosophy of the cup is follows. The cloth motif is on the cup symbolizes, symbolizes the Ottomans. The geometric handle, the Celtic culture, and the cylindrical form, the Republic, which carries both cultures to the present. Drawing of the coffee cup mode by using Rancor program. 
computerized drawing and uh, virtual uh, modeling of all more pieces which are necessary for the cover cups testing process. Cups product product with using the testing method. First, I first I shape the cylindrical form of the of the cup by casting. Then I place the finished cylindrical form into this uh, mold and cast the, the handle part. So uh, the inside is clean. Uh, and it, it is easier so, to cast this part, otherwise it will be not possible. Uh, since both sides of the lower most part of the mold must be machined, it is crowded in a farm on the CNC machining of both sides of the middle part of copper cup is finished. Finally, the part is cut from the edges and taken out the crown. As of for this piece, uh, we work so as for this piece, we work so much, it, it, this was much easier than this was. This Turkish cover cup uh, rejoined the Golden Art Design Award in Italy in uh, 2017 with a happy ending. You see the cut log page on the side. Uh, the product was later exhibited, uh, another design exhibition, that exhibition next door image of the poster. Our third design is, uh, is a plate with an oval glazed pattern, finished by using potter's wheel in 2000. Same plate finished by using potter's wheel and by using porcelain casting clay on CNC mode. The same is blue. Technical drawing of the plaster mold to be used for interior of the plate with figure as drawn by using Rancher source program for loading to CNC. A thinner drill um, is used for the finer detail when curving plaster molds on CNC. This picture shows finished curving of interior and exterior phases of plaster plate molds. In conclusion, the purpose of this study was to emphasize on the wide range to of application of the self sufficient independent tool potter's wheel and see how much and what kind of result CNC can contribute to the existing designs by actually using it. Each and every product made by using potter's wheel is an unique, even if you perform mass production. The trajectories of the artist's hand stay with the product until the destroying of the object. CNC, on the other hand, provides perfection and mechanical failing to the product, which also gives an unique, elegant look. <clears throat> and a prima, 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 primary purpose here is mass production. What we wanted to do was to combine the warmth of potter's wheel and precision of CNC bench into a mass production ray. I think the most important thing here is the audience of dependence per single tool or research during the creation of a design or of an artwork. A single research leads to monotony. The creation process needs a wide playground with many options. We need to keep all canals and gates open to invite our sources of inspiration to trigger and enrich our creativity. Since it has been widely used in our ceramic industry, 
for the production of floor and wall tiles and as as well as sanitary devices since more than 20 years. However, it is not used widely in educational institutions. Nonetheless, this is not the case of the countries of origin of these slates. I observed that in design schools abroad, CNC is just a tool, one of the many, another one. Make it mandatory to use it CNC letters in the industry for a particular purpose by utilization of CNC letters in schools will enable thousands of young minds brainstorm. Another important advantage that CNC has brought into mass ceramic production. In the past, we first had to make a technical drawing and then build a plaster model of product. product. Then we have to make a bold product, product the necessity plaster molds by using plaster before going into mass production. However, CNC allows us to draw the model on a computer then draw the models by using the model drawing, place plaster blocks onto CNC tool and load the necessary commands to your CNC tool by using the date obtained from your drawing. Product, production of molds without first making plaster models is time saving and frees us from unpleasant plaster work also, direct prod production of mold provides significant advantages in some difficult to impossible cases. For example, our second design, the Turkish coffee cup, if you first attempt to make the, a plaster model of the handle, it would have been very difficult and the product would not have been as perfect as this one or we would not have obtained the same level of smoothness in the case of plate with pattern. Uh, people teaching your serum, I cannot show the film. It is a film about the CNC, but it is a pity if I cannot. This study was has been possible for former research assistant Mr. Odekan, valuable contribution. Thank you, Sinan Odekan. Uh, thank you. I could never conduct such a study alone. First of all, the vast CNC and computer added drawing experience and knowledge of Sinan Odekan, research associate at the Industrial Design Department of ITU, Architecture Faculty, made it possible for me to conduct this experiment, therefore, I would like to extend my sense that thanks to Mr. Sinan Edekan for supporting this project by spending his off time with me, former ITU Industrial Design Department Presidency, Professor Dr. Alpai R. for letting me use their CNC studio for the experiment. And finance department presidency assistant professor Dr. Former, now is professor, I think, uh, Yuxel Demir and lecturer Mrs. Aynur Karaj for letting us to use their ceramic studio for the creation of ceramic products. And many thanks to the lecturer Abdikin Özsekin of Marmara University C Finance Faculty for the teaching me the Rhine Source Drawings Method. Um, thank Thank you for attention. It is all. <laughs> Thank you, Günger Hocam. Thank you for presentation. It is it was very informative for us. Yeah. Uh, would you like to add anything uh, to your presentation? Uh, I haven't heard you. Is this what you said? Uh, would you like to add anything else? No, it is it is all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it mm -hmm. is all. Thank you, thank you, Gungor I, I, uh, It is also available uh, on, on YouTube uh, for watching after this session. And thank you for our guests uh, for your attention.
Yeah. Have a good for your attention. Okay. Have a good day and evening. Goodbye, Hojo. Goodbye. Yeah.